So one of the great things that you can do with a lab scope is compare relationships between multiple sensors on a vehicle. For example, this BMW has got two different cam sensors and a crank sensor. So if you ever had a suspected timing issue or something like that, you can go in and compare the relationships between the three things. So let's walk through how we do that. All right, so I have the scope hooked up here, three channels. I got the crank sensor on channel one, uh, the intake cam sensor on channel two, and the exhaust cam sensor on channel three. So let's go fire up the car and see what we get for a pattern. All right, looks pretty good. All right, so it looks like we're in a little tight here, so let's zoom out a little bit and see if we can get a better look at this pattern overall. Zoom out a little bit, let's see here. There we go. So here is one revolution of the engine right here within these two cursors. This blank spot right here is top dead center on the crank. And we can also see how the intake cam and the exhaust cam time out against each other and see the correlation between the three. So if you have a cam timing problem, you could also do this with one single cam sensor and a single crank sensor. But if you have some sort of timing issue that you want to look at, check the correlation between them and that should help you diagnose it.